It truly is a special place, a stadium every football fan should visit should he or she get the chance. The Santiago Bernabeu here in Madrid. I'm Derek Ray, positioned here on the commentary gantry, and alongside me at the microphone is Stuart Robson. An action coming up from the Spanish top division, La Liga. It's Real Madrid, and they face Cadiz. Well, Derek, as is always the case, the team that dominates midfield would be the team that controls the flow of the game. And that, for me, is the area that's key today. And let's dissect the Real Madrid side. Nacho Fernandez plays with Antonio Rudiger in central defence. Toni Kroos plays alongside Federico Valverde in central midfield. And so many different ways to configure an attack. In this case, it'll be two men up front. And cleared away. That's very effective. Good high pressing. Well, they'll be happy to have regained possession. Oh, that is an outrageously good stop. Well, great reflexes from the keeper. He did brilliantly there. Let's see about the delivery. It might still be problematic. Well, he stopped them in their tracks. Oh, managing to beat him. Chust. And it's with Hernandez. Carcelen Luis Hernandez now with Alcaraz Chris Ramos well good run and good ball control cuts it back great opportunity stopped a certain goal Chris Ramos Alex Fernandez on attacking possibilities. That's really good and effective physical play. Good use of the ball, but can they trouble the defence? Under pressure, doesn't seem to be bothering him. Well, sadly, they just couldn't keep possession. Federico Valverde. Trying to really get at the opposition here. Valverde. A chance to whip it in. Course. Chance to put them in front. Textbook defending inside the box. Ruben Alcaraz. Really inventive stuff from Real here. Has someone to play it to. Might be dangerous. Oh, great defending. Ivan Alejo. Well, he's certainly not alone. Alex Fernandez. And now with Roger. Very quick thinking there. Being pressed here. Valverde. And now Rodrigo. Bellingham. Good run, very much in control of the situation. And that is that half-time here in the Spanish capital.
Well, quite simply, he hasn't been able to make his mark an attack in this game, Stuart. Well, he's been off the pace so far. He's struggled to get on the ball. He's not looked threatening, and his movement just hasn't been good enough. Well, they've got things going again here, and I wonder what kind of second half we have in store for us. Passing it around, looking for the goal that would put them ahead. Good strength to keep the ball. Well, that's how to keep the opposition at bay. Vinicius Jr. Well, the fans really want him to shoot. Well, that's really strong play to keep hold of the ball. And still looking for space. The importance of that tackle cannot be overstated. High pressing at its best. Course. Can he take the chance? And he's outdone himself. Wonderful save there. There has been plenty of limbering up from substitutes. And now both sides will make personnel switches. Short corner favor. Danger averted for now, but it'll be another corner. Well, just listen to these fans. They're urging their team to score here and take the lead. Substitution for Real Madrid. They take it short. Nacho. Oh, might be. And a goal to open the scoring. No wonder they're celebrating. Well, just look at his movement. He knows exactly how to find space. And it's also a tidy finish. That's a nice goal. And back underway, 1-0 it is. Ruben Alcaraz. On to Alcaraz. Luis Hernandez. Juan Mi on the ball. Hernandez. Ruben Alcaraz. Well, the attack looks promising. Cuts it back. Oh, good defending to stop a decent looking attack. Mendy. Aurelia Chuameni. 15 minutes left for play. Untidy in possession. Moving the ball nicely. Trying to carve out the equaliser. Now he must favour the cross. Gomez. And a chance to level it. Oh, a challenge that simply had to be won. Might be a chance to break. 
Bellingham is with Jose Lu. Valverde. That is a very fine challenge in difficult circumstances. Alex Fernandez. On to Alcaraz. Maximiliano Gomez. Well, late in the game here, they know what they need, and that's an equaliser. A well, fine reading of the situation. Bellingham. And Bellingham. Well, the defenders know they need to get tighter. Determined defending. Look at Modric. And the keeper more than equal to it. And it is substitution time at this juncture. Not just from one side, but from both. Playing it short. Jose Lu. Top notch defending, but the chance still there. And that is that, the end of the game. It goes into the books as a win for Real Madrid. What did you think of their overall performance? Well, Derek, it was a really tight game, but they were the better side over the 90 minutes, and they fully deserved their victory today. Well, you know, when our colleagues in the newspapers come out with their grades for this match, he's going to get very high marks. Well, he gave them a really hard time, didn't he? His speed of thought was excellent, and he took the winning goal so well. He was brilliant today.